Good day, Wonder Nurses. I'm Nurse Anne. Today, we will talk about monkeypox. Let's tackle the important information that you need to know about this current communicable disease. So if you're ready, let's start. What is monkeypox? According to CDC or the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, Monkeypox is a rare disease caused by infection with the monkeypox virus. Monkeypox virus is an envelope double-stranded DNA virus that belongs to the orthopox virus genus of the Paxviridae family. It is also a part of the same family of viruses as the variola virus, the virus that causes smallpox. For the brief history, monkeypox was first discovered in 1958 that occurred in colonies of monkeys that were kept for research. The first human case was recorded in 1970. Before the 2022 outbreak, monkeypox is already reported in several Central and Western African countries. How does it spread. Direct contact with monkeypox rush, scabs, or body fluids. Touching contaminated objects like beddings, towels, or clothing of someone with monkeypox. Contact with respiratory secretions. It is also sexually transmitted. Placental transmission from the infected mother to the fetus. Finally, it is also possible to get monkeypox from infected animals, like scratches and bites, or by preparing or eating an infected animal. For the incubation period, according to the WHO, it is usually from 6 to 13 days, but can range from 5 to 21 days. For the signs and symptoms, according to the WHO, Monkeypox is usually a self-limited disease with symptoms lasting from 2 to 4 weeks. Manifestations are fever, headache, muscle aches and backache, swollen lymph nodes, chills, exhaustion, respiratory symptoms like sore throat, nasal congestion or cough. Finally, a rash that may be located on or near the genitals or anus, but could also be on other areas like the hands, feet, chest, face, or mouth. The rash can look like pimples or blisters and may be painful or itchy. The infected person may experience all or only a few symptoms. But most people with monkeypox will get a rush. Usually when the infected individual experiences flu-like symptoms, a rush will develop one to four days later. Let's proceed to treatment. As of now, there are no treatments specifically for monkeypox virus infections. However, monkeypox and smallpox viruses are genetically similar, which means that antiviral drugs and vaccines developed to protect against smallpox may be used to prevent and treat monkeypox virus infections. Antivirals such as tecovirimat may be recommended for people who are more likely to get severely ill like patients with weakened immune systems. Lastly, prevention. Increase awareness of the risk factors and health education to reduce exposure to the virus. Avoid close, skin-to-skin -skin contact with people who have a rash that looks like monkeypox. Avoid contact with objects and materials that a person with monkeypox has used. Proper hand washing and use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer especially before eating or touching your face. CDC also recommends vaccination 
for people who have been exposed to monkeypox and people who may be more likely to get monkeypox. This includes people who have been identified by public health officials as having contact with someone with monkeypox, and people who are aware that one of their sexual partners in the past two weeks has been diagnosed with monkeypox. According to the WHO, vaccination against smallpox was demonstrated through several observational studies to be about 85% effective in preventing monkeypox. Finally, avoid sexual contact with the person who has suspected case of monkeypox. That's it for today. I hope you learn and understand our topic. Keep on learning, nurses! Thank you for listening. I hope you learn and understand something. If you want more videos, don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.